relaxation into the first excited singlet state. Yes, yes, apparently we know. Reduce atmospheric nitrogen by 0.03%. It's a trap! Chaotic here, and the Force is strong with us today as we are playing the open beta of Star Wars Battlefront. I was a little little worried about the game. Uh, I liked I liked one and two. They were they were good games for their time. I was a little worried about how it would be handled. I figured it would just be, you know, Battlefield with Star Wars skins. But I was mistaken. I was I was wrong. The first thing I noticed when starting the game is you cannot turn off the music. So that's uh I don't, I don't know what kind of decision that was. The other decision is there is no voice communications whatsoever in the game. None. You can't, you can't talk to your friends unless you're on TeamSpeak or in a, in a Origin call because you have to download Origin for, for this. Uh, There's all the stuff that's locked right now. But so far we get Drop Zone and Walker Assault, so we get two maps. That's it. That's all we get. So for for starters, I just decided to hop on. A single player survival wave based on tattooing just to get a feel for the game. Where we are greeted by none other than Admiral Akbar. It's our trap. It's our crap. It's our snack. Yeah, he tells you, uh, he tell, pretty much tells you, uh, you're fucked, don't die. And you just kind of run around, you collect power ups, you get drops, you have to secure the drop. And then you get points and special little power-ups and stuff. This little bird looks suspiciously like an eagle or a hawk. And all like they're shooting at me, still can't hit shit. Look at him. Look at him right in front of him. But I just wanted to get a feel for the controls and everything before I, I just hopped into a game online. Didn't want to look like a total noob, you know. It's been a while since I played shooters like this anyway. I played too much Ark and, and Rust and shit. Arma. Yeah, this is an arma. This is an arma at all. So I just wanted to get a feel for everything, and it was. Uh, I like the controls. I like the graphics. Everything's smooth. I was getting really good frames while recording. Never had any lag spikes or anything like that. So it's 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 pretty good for an open beta. I'm uh, I'm actually surprised. Now the Walker Assault map is pretty intense. Uh, as the Rebel Faction, you have to protect and activate your uplinks to begin Y-Wing bombings on the Walkers. So there's indoor, you know, in, in your little your little cave base. Or there's also outdoor, obviously, because Walkers can't fit indoors, now can they? So you have to protect the uplinks and activate them and bomb it and blow up the Walkers, right? Sounds easy. Not really. Uh, the power-up system is pretty cool. They're all spread around the map. They're all spread around the map, so it gives everyone a fair chance to get them. Like, there's one right there. Shows up, clears day, you can see it. Go get it. Don't know what to do with it, but I'm going to use it anyway. So you call in a Y-Wing that you control, and I didn't know I didn't know what to do with it. it. It did look cool, but I totally wasted it and just crashed it. Another cool power-up I got to play with early on is the hero pickup. Luke Skywalker to the rescue like a boss. Yeah, there he goes. Mark Hamill like a motherfucker. May the force be with us. Let's kill some people. I didn't know what to do with it, honestly. I just I ran around until I found people to kill and just, just kept hacking away. There they go. Die. Die. You die too. Block that shit. Kill you. Hop around like a bunny, bunny on crack, and then eventually I die. So the Luke Skywalker is pretty fun, and of course at the end of every every game you get your your rank up and your your experience points, which you can use to unlock different items, and then you use the money you earn in the game to to, to unlock the different weapons and stuff you want. All in all, I'm pretty impressed with the game. Um, it's it brings back the feel of the old games, brings back some elements that work, changes some like so the power ups they just they're just randomly spread around the map. The the special ones like Luke and Darth Vader. So I gets everyone a fair chance. The graphics are awesome. Battle's pretty epic right here. I can't wait to see the rest of them. I'm not I'm not so upset that there's no space battles. Um, it's it's fine as long as the game's fun. 
I got another game who wants space battles like that anyway, so it's no big deal. I would recommend trying it while it's still open beta. I don't know how long it's going to last, but you should try it out, and I will definitely be picking this up.